Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Have you seen the new SIG P320 Flux Legion? This is it right here. You look at this and you say, well, that's just another kit. That's just, we've seen that before. Well, it's actually not. Let me explain, and here is an example. This here is a kit. It's a Recover Tactical kit for a Glock. Basically, comes up like that. You throw the handgun in there, you shut it, lock it into place in various places, and you have a kit with a brace and everything else. Okay, that's a kit. You have your handgun, the kit, they are separate. This is all in one. This is a collaboration between Flux Defense and Sig Sauer to create the P320 Flux. It is a Flux Legion. So it has a Cerakote gray all throughout. It's Legion gray, and Sig wants to make sure that is known. But the handgun itself is a Sig P320 AXG Legion with a 3.9 inch barrel and integrated compensator. We're seeing these all the time now. The sight system is x-ray three sights even in the rear okay so you put an optic on here and this will give the stability of a pcc pistol caliber carbine because this brace will deploy i'm going to show that this is this is really cool but if for some reason your optic goes out you can access your sights right through there all right i don't know if the camera's picking that up but you can that it has that basically a large witness hole you put an optic on this pick rail right there you're good to go this is a rapid deploy brace so it looks like it's stable there and it is stable but this lever here you just push it down wait for it there we go there's the brace and it is very sturdy okay you see that red spring right there all right, that's what holds it into place. It locks into place. So when I want to do that, I hit that same lever, basically break it loose, push it in there, and then it is in its smallest form. Pretty crazy. I'll show you that again. Look at that. Wow. And then just break it and then push it in. All right, so you get the stability of a brace. You can SBR it if that's your choice. Not sure why anybody would do that, but people are, people are strange when you're restrict all right enough of me this is a uh, safety right here you push it down that is fire and it is ambidextrous and what you'll notice is a lot of this is ambidextrous okay same thing right there there's your safety that is ambidextrous it has a pick rail right there and you can see this is all one piece the whole frame is made by flux it is the chassis so the upper is all SIG, well it's all it's all SIG if you will, but the upper is an AXG Legion, the lower is a chassis. I couldn't remove this handgun if I tried, it's all in one. It also has a, well I talked about the pick rail here, an ambi mag release. So this is the mag that is being used if, well, let me get rid of, uh, or at least get that out of the way. This lever here will drop the mag. Now it does come with two 29 round mags, all right? So I can remove it that way. I can also remove it with my trigger finger with that lever right there. Is that gonna release the spare mag? No, it's going to release the primary mag right there, all right? And it does have a flared mag well. Yeah, I could drop this and then take this mag and put it in and I, that would be a fresh reload okay i can do it that way or there's a super cool function here i could do it even better check this out okay i'm gonna push in a little bit harder and then there's my quick reload did you see that basically i can push it in it drops both so as i push in i'm grabbing this and this one's dropping that is one fast reload okay if i push it in just slightly i can grab this this one is staying in place there is the legion symbol and there is the business end if you like a sig axg and you'll you'll really dig this now this is optic ready you're not going to use that that's just there because they used the sig axg slide and they are all optic ready you're not going to use that you're going to use this rail right here to put an optic on something like this all right 
okay, with a with a mount for a pick rail. But it does have a couple QD mounts here, there, one on the brace. It does have a very nice grip. And in terms of the gun itself, well, let me drop the mags. I could have dropped them both. But I'll go ahead and show. This is, I've got the safety on. It's got the flat skeletonized trigger and it's all it's all sig just like the 320 p320 and you notice that because the strike is really really soft same with the p365 series the strike is really soft but what else will be soft is the shooting impressions because it has that comp whether you like them or not they are i, I think they're here to stay sort of like when red dots first came out People were either for them or against them. Well, now comps are out, and they are making their way into every manufacturer, that's for sure. If you go with this, it comes in this big case right here. It is lockable right there. You could throw a lock on there and seal this thing up. But there is the P320 Flux Legion, the 229 round. But you're wondering, how much is this thing? Well, good question. You're looking at right around fifteen to sixteen hundred bucks for the Sig P320 Flux Legion. This is different. It, it, even though it says Raider there, Flux Defense has a Raider line, and, and they do use six-hour handguns. That is more of a kit. This is a whole Flux chassis, above and beyond just six-hour. So it's a collaboration. It looks super cool. I really dig the way that works. I love the way the magazines drop together. I like the way you can access your iron sights through there. You have an optic there. Yeah, you only have a 3.9 inch barrel, but it's comp super easy to shoot with the stability of a brace and that compensator. Wow, I, I really think this is cool. Now it's more expensive than a kit. There's no doubt about that. It's more expensive than the kit. And you can't take it apart and use the handgun and holster it. But you do have the stability of the brace and the compensator for easy shooting. And it folds up real nice. Just like that. And I, I think it's cool. I think it's different. I think it's innovative. And I really like this collaboration that SIG did with Flux Defense and... Whether you dig it or not, I'm happy to show it to you because I think it is really a neat concept. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.